Dear friends, I knew that you are graduated from Faculty of Engineering, Aeronautical, Electrical, Mechanical, also graduated from high school. So the um, arithmetic is very easy for you, but the IASA approvals need to pass the IASA modules, which contains the first module is mathematics. So I will try to make IASA modules simple. I will take the guide of the useful book, which called Aviation Maintenance Technician Certification Series. The author is Mr. Thomas Fordzen and contributor Victor Bolton, dated August 2015. The module one here, mathematics, the submodule, the first submodule is arithmetic. It will begin with the whole number. What is the whole numbers? The whole or integer numbers are positive numbers, including zero, without any decimal or fractions parts. They are numbers that represent whole things without pieces. Look here. These are Arabic numbers. 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, and so on. And this figure is the Roman number. Take care here, the Roman number the Roman number has no zero digits. And this is the Indian number. If I want to represent these numbers on the aircraft, as example, this is the aircraft. It has one body or one fuselage here and two wings, one, two, three and en two engines, one, if I want three, three represents the hydraulic systems. In Boeing, the systems are system A, system B, and standby. In Airbus, the three systems are red, blue, yellow. If I want to represent the F integer four, there are four main entry doors, two at the front and two at aft, left and right, left and right. Five, there are five slats per wing. Each wing has five slats here at the leading edge of the wing. One, two, three, four, five. Six. The digit six represents the speed brakes on the two wings. Here are three, one, two, three speed brakes at each wing. Seven, there are a check called weekly or service check each seven calendar days. If more than one digit here, the aircraft had the seats, 180 seats, maybe 186. This is for Airbus 320. We need now place value chart to put each number in each its place. If I will take this number, we put it in the chart here. The chart here, ones or units, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousand, hundred thousand, million. So if we want to represent here, take this, the fairest from the right here, 
take care the seven from the right and put it at the right hand seven here and the one one and the ten here three and the hundred four and thousand and so on if we go to the addition of the whole numbers the first simple one is one digit plus one digit here six plus one maybe right as uh, horizontal or vertical each parameter from the addition here called addend the result called sum so six plus one six plus one equals seven this is a simple one the second seven plus four seven plus four equal eleven take care here one in the place of ones and the other one in the place of ten so this is eleven if we don't add two digits like this this is two digits and two digits six plus seven six plus seven equals thirteen we write here three and carry over or carry up one in the tenth place one plus three four plus one five here fifty seven another example here fifty eight plus forty six we begin the, at the right eight plus six fourteen right four and carry up or carry over one here one plus five six six plus four ten this is the sum if we want several digits more digits we could we would here one two three four one two three one two one two three one two so we need to put each number here each digit of it in the right value place so here this is here eight and the ones three and the ten four and hundred five and the thousand and so on now we want to add eight plus three eleven eleven plus two equal thirteen 13 plus 4, 17. 17 plus 0, 17. So we will write here 7 and carry up or carry over 1 in the 10 place. 1 plus 3, 4. Plus 3, 7. 15. 20. 23. 3 and carry up 2 in the 100 place. 2 plus 4, 6, plus 2, 8, plus 2, 10, 0, and carry up 1, 1 plus 5, 6. Okay, the second video, we will continue to make subtraction and so on. Bye.